guys welcome back to my channel it's my renee here if you're new welcome so i did an outfit of the day video for you guys featuring a soft glam look i absolutely love how this look turned out it is so me um i also showed you guys what fragrance i'm wearing and i also showed you guys my cute teddy blake bag that i recently got um details will be in the description box below and i'm also going to include all the brushes that i use with the links i did a video previously on that but i will have that list in the order i used each brush and product um, down below so do check that out so if you're interested in seeing how i achieved this look and also seeing my outfit then keep on watching So today I'm going to be doing a soft glam. It's very simple, very easy. I'm going to be working from my Morphe 3502 palette and I'll be using these two colors right here. I'll be applying this lighter shade first and then go in with this color in the crease area. So I'm going to go in with my Morphe M441 brush and apply that lighter shade all over my lids.
one of my favorite eyeshadow combos to do but as you saw the um darker shade is like i hit pan and i only have a little bit left so i try not to use it as much but i love doing this eyeshadow combo i love the colors together but as you can see this look is very simple it's very basic and it's extremely soft i'm going to keep it matte i don't want to add any shimmer so now i'm going to go ahead and highlight I'm gonna be using my Too Faced concealers in the shade Butterscotch, which is the darker shade. And then I'm gonna apply Warm Sand, which is a lighter shade. So Butterscotch first and then Warm Sand. Now going in with my Laura Mercier translucent powder in Honey. Now I'm going to go in with my Sephora Micro Smooth Powder to set my face. So now I'm gonna bronze with my Morphe bronzer in the shade Trailblazer.
And for blush, I'm going in with my favorite format from MAC. So now I'm going to highlight using my Milani highlighter in the shade 140. a bit of highlight on my brow bone not too much I'm gonna go in with that same brown I used in my crease and apply that to my lower lash line Okay, so I applied my lashes. I'm wearing these ones, E04 today. It's from the same vendor. The link will be below. So moving on to lips, my favorite part. I'm gonna be using this lip liner from Morphe that I recently purchased. It's called Bite Me. It's a beautiful shade of brown and I'm gonna outline my lips. Okay, it's not dark enough for me so it's more so of a fill-in lip color for me so i'm gonna go in with my kkw nude 3 lip liner to outline my lips and i'm gonna fill in with my mac cork For today's lipstick, I'm going to go in with my KKW Nude 2.5. And I'm going to top it with my Myth Lip Gloss from MAC. It's 
so I love how this look turned out. This is definitely me. Um, I love everything about it and I love these lashes as well. So I'm going to take my hair out of this wrap and then get dressed and show you guys my outfit. All right, so I took my hair out of the wrap. This is what we have going on. This is how my hair is looking. This is actually week two for me. I washed it a couple days ago and I flat ironed it again. I do have a video up on my channel already just showing you my wash day routine on when I'm going to flat iron my hair. But um, I was feeling it the first time so I had to go again and flat iron it and I'm just loving my hair. And for anyone wondering, I hit eight weeks um, post relaxer. I'll be getting a touch up real soon. But yes, this is my hair. I absolutely love it. So before I show you guys my outfit, I'm gonna go ahead and spray on some perfume. What I'm wearing today is from Burberry. It's called Touch for Women. This scent is amazing. And every time I wear it, I always get complimented. Mm, like it smells so good. So I don't know about you, but I love me a cute handbag. And the bag I am rocking today is from Teddy Blake. This is their Kate Vitello in beige. I have it in nine inches. it's so cute it's so classy it's so my style i love the structure of it and i am a huge fan of mini bags i think they're so cute and they just tie in the whole look for me like ah, it's so cute now teddy blake they have such a good selection of handbags in a variety of colors to choose from so i am certain that you will definitely find a style and a color that will suit you this bag right here comes in so many pretty colors it was so hard for me to choose i saw it in cobalt blue i saw it in yellow i saw it in orange but i went with beige because i don't have a handbag in this color and as much as i was tempted to get something bright beige is such a neutral color and i can literally wear this bag all year round regardless of the season so beige one and i really didn't want to get another black handbag well, at least for now. All of Teddy Blake's handbags are made with premium Italian leather and they're made in Italy. When I look at this bag, I see high end, I see luxury, and I see quality. And I am here for anything made of good quality, especially when it comes to handbags. Teddy Blake is giving you beautiful luxury handbags at such a fair price. Like, who doesn't love a good handbag made of good quality for such a good price? Who doesn't? So big shout out to Teddy Blake for sending me this beautiful handbag. This has become a staple and I'm so happy to add it to my bag collection. Be sure to check Teddy Blake out if you haven't done so already and also check the description box below for more details on this cutie right here. So this is my outfit for today. If you watched my recent try on haul video, you would have seen this sweater. It's from Fashion Nova. I'm also wearing the black pants that came in my package. Um, I'll have that linked below and I have my Teddy Blake handbag. I did take some pictures so I'm going to insert photos for you guys to see the whole look. you guys so this is the final look i hope you enjoyed this video as always i will have all details in the description box below so do check that out remember to like comment and subscribe and follow me on instagram at tamara renee thank you guys so much for watching and i will see my next video bye